I've spent the last five years growing hemp legally in the state of Minnesota and I have state and federal permits and I grow fiber hemp. And what I see is we can make anything that they used to make out of fossil fuels, we can make it out of hemp. Now we're making the right choice and we're growing hemp so that we can make a textiles economy out of it, a materials economy out of it and make hemp batteries for the future so that we don't need to mine lithium. People have realized that you need to have local energy infrastructure because the grid will go down. The people have realized that you need to have local food infrastructure and use a lot less fossil fuels to get it. And that um, people have realized that hemp is part of the next economy. We call it the new green revolution. Our community, the indigenous community, is working to bring uh, fiber hemp into the next economy. I am tremendously optimistic about people's ability to transform our societies and our communities. And in that, I also know that there's much more joy in an economy that has good heart in it. And so, you know, as I look across Indian country and I look across the North, what I see is uh, tribes taking leadership in solar energy. I see our community doing solar thermal, where we are uh, producing on the reservation solar thermal panels that we can provide so that all people can have more heat in their homes and don't have to rely on oil companies for their heat. A lot more people are going to be involved and are gonna want those. You can follow us on honorearth.org where you can see what we're doing in terms of the just transition in bringing solar energy forth in Northern Minnesota as well as hemp and all of our work to transform the economy of Northern Minnesota. Help us build the just transition. Help us build the next economy.